welcome back to my channel so today is gonna be a haul video as you guys know I don't do a lot of hauls I just find them to be a little tedious with the whole bringing everything out and then packing everything up and putting it away I just get a little lazy I was gonna do a fall haul for you guys but it didn't work out so I decided to do a um, another haul now so I've been picking up quite a few things lately and I just thought I'd share with you guys so you guys can kind of see what I've been um, loving or picking up or buying lately just, you know, give you ideas in case, you know, you need any, like, Christmas gift ideas. I don't know what I'm rambling about. Just let's get to the haul. So I ended up, I picked up a few uh, body care items, some candles, some clothing items, and a few things. So I think I'm going to start with the, um, with the MAC. I, I purchased a few things at MAC, the MAC website, and um, got a few things. So I want to share those with you guys. The first thing that I got is the MAC Pro Palette. And this is what it looks like. It's probably already dirty because this material or whatever this case is, it gets dirty very quickly. This is what it looks like. It comes and when you first purchase it, it's empty. But I also purchased the inserts that go with it so that um, I would have um, something to put my eyeshadows in. So if you look down here, this first top part is for six eyeshadows. And then it has a little plastic that divides both sides. And the other side can hold up to 15 eyeshadows. So the palette itself was only $8. And then the inserts were like $2 each. I mean, like, I was so surprised by how cheap the palette and the inserts were that I actually called, like, the MAC number and was like, is somebody playing a trick on me? Why is it so cheap? Because everybody told me they got it for like $25. And I was not expecting it to be $8. So I was a little skeptical. But they said, yep, that's the price. The next thing I got was just some refills of things. I got um, the Pro, Pro Long Wear Concealer. And this is in shade NC45. Uh, my skin is really weird. I am really red in the summer. And I have to wear NW. And then in the winter... I get very yellow and then I have to switch and wear NC. Like in the summer, um, I wear NW45 and in the winter, I wear N NC50 in, in my Fix Away Foundation. So I had to pick up a new Pro Long Wear Concealer and this one is, like I said, in the shade NC45. Next thing that I got from MAC is, of course, my foundation for the winter. Um, this is the Fix Away Foundation in NC50. This is what that looks like in case you guys haven't seen it i'm sure you have you don't need to see it this is what it looks like yeah next thing that i got from mac i don't have too many things from mac next thing that i got was the pigment old gold and that's what i have on my eyelids right now if you guys can see that i zoom you in so that's it I really like it. I really like the pigment. It's like this greenish gold dual chrome color. I really hope you guys can see that. Um, it's a very pretty, pretty, pretty color. So, yeah. So, I only got one more thing at MAC. Um, because I didn't want to go too crazy. Because The Rihanna Holiday Collection is coming out tomorrow. So, I wanted to have some money left over for that so <laughs> i couldn't go too crazy the last thing that i got i've never actually tried this blush before and i've always wanted to this is love joy this is a blush by mac called love joy this is what it looks like i'm wearing it on my cheeks right now and um it's pretty i guess i have to just play around a little bit more to figure out if i like it or not i thought it was going to be a lot more pigmented than than what it is um it's coming off a little sheer on me so um it doesn't work out i'll just pop it into my freelance kit because i'm sure i'll always have a client with a skin tone that will work out for this one so let's move on i also stopped i also did a little bit of black friday shopping i actually worked on black friday so i couldn't pick up a lot of things but i ended up picking up two things from sephora and um these are things that i wanted to try but i never wanted to be full price for and the first thing is the purity um soap it's like a cleanser it was only $10. They had the whole $10 sale on Black Friday um, at Sephora. So I got this for $10. And this is the 12 fluid ounce. So it's on the biggest bottle. 
I've really enjoyed putting it on, uh, cleaning my face with it so far. I have to use it a little bit longer to decide if I there's something that I really want to like completely switch from my uh, cleanser to start using that one. The next thing that I got from Sephora is the Pink Sugar Perfume. This is what it looks like. This was also $10 at Sephora on Black Friday. And I'm so sorry that I keep looking over there. Um, this is the first time that I use a camera that actually has a viewfinder. So it's really weird right now, not having to look at myself and having to actually look at the camera. Um, the next place that I went to was Bath and Body Works. And I picked up two candles uh, for the winter. So the first one I got was Pumpkin Cupcake. This is Pumpkin Cupcake. And that's what it looks like. It's one of the three week candles. And I got it when it was two for 22. I just think it smells really good. I hate the smell of pumpkin and I'm glad that I can't smell pumpkin in this. So really good candle. The other one that I got, which two for 22, I got two of course, is um, Marshmallow Fi Side. This is what Marshmallow Fi Side looks like. And it's another three-way candle. I've been, I burnt this one today. I really like, really, really, really like this one. And if you, I'm sure you guys are familiar with this candle. Everybody and their mother and father and cousin on YouTube talks about this candle. So we're not going to talk about it too much. And I'm horrible at describing scents. So all I can say is that they have a very sweet, big, good scent. And which is what I like in my candles. Now we're going to move on to clothing items. I picked up. Um, two things from JC Penny and before I show you guys I just want to let everybody know like do not sleep on JC Penny like I used to think that JC Penny was just this place where all women went to go buy their clothes like they have come so far I have been getting so many pieces from JC Penny they have such such cute items so I stopped by there and I picked up this um, fur vest this is what it looks like. It's really, really cute. Um, it's really nice. And it feels super, it feels super, super soft. And this one was a little pricey. This was $72, um, but I had a little discount, so that worked out. And just so you know, I think they're having their friends and family event. JCPenney is having their friends and family event this Sunday where you get an extra 25% off. So um, if you're looking for some new fall or wintery pieces, now would be a great time to go pick them up with the extra 20%, 25% off. Also from JCPenney's is this jacket right here. It's just like a black cropped style blazer. And it, like, like holding it right now does not really do it any justice. Let me see if I can scoot back. It's one of those loose lapels uh, blazers. It's not really cropped. It's just short. Um, I am petite. I'm like five foot five one, maybe. Um, and it hits me just right. My waist is very short, and sometimes some blazers can look really, really long on me. So I really like this one. This is what it looks like. Um, it has a very nice cut to it. This will be coming up in either a getting ready with me video, an outfit of the day video or something along that line because this looks way better on than it does just holding it like this. Okay, so that's it for the clothing items that I picked up. Now, one of the things that I have been saving up to purchase and trying to purchase for a really, really long time was a new camera. Um, as you guys know, I've been using the same camera for about a year and a half now. And I, it, it, it looked great. Like if you look at my last videos, my videos were always pretty clear and the quality was pretty decent. But I felt that it was about time that I upgraded to something more. And I went and got the camera everybody else has seen on YouTube. Yes, don't judge me. I got the um, Canon Rebel T3i. Um, everybody is upgrading to the T5i, but if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So I just got the T3i. And I got it on a really good sale on... Was it Black Friday or Cyber Monday? I can't remember. One of those. Um, so yeah, I just... I love it. It's great. Oh, it was Black Friday. It was Cyber Monday because I got it in store. So I really, 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 really like this camera. This is what I'm filming on right now. And I really hope that you guys can see... A little bit of a, a difference because if you don't then that would 
superbly suck. I'm really, really um, happy that I finally started upgrading my camera, my room, lighting. I mean, everything is just starting to look professional over here. But anyway, um, I think that's it for the haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I will be having a, another haul um, coming up maybe in a few weeks or so. That will be more of just like a clothing haul. So for all you divas who um, want to just hear about the clothing and not my other stuff that I like to buy and ramble on about, then definitely stay tuned for that haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!